Hi guys, this is Vineet. In today's video, we will discuss about how you can change the compatibility level of a database inside SQL Server. Uh, let's go to notes quickly and uh, the topic is how you can view or change the compatibility level of a database. There will be two demos uh, to view the to view all change compatibility level of a database using SQL Server Management Studio DUI mode and another one is uh, using the SQL Server Management uh, T SQL mode. So let's quickly go to SQL Server. Uh, let me directly take you to the demos. There is no theory associated with this session. So we will directly do the practicals. So let me connect to the default instance of SQL Server and we need to expand the databases section. So let's check the compatibility level of uh, sample DB. We can um, either select a user database or a system database. We need to right click on the database and select properties. So let's go inside properties. Maximize this window. On the left hand side uh, there is an option section. Over the top area you will see compatibility level of a database. Uh, the compatibility level of this database is at 2, SQL Server 2022. And basically if you want to migrate this database to some other machine which is running a lower version of SQL Server, so what we can do is we can reduce the compatibility level to a lower version, then yeah, we can migrate this database to a lower level version. Right now it's set to use the highest level which is SQL Server 2022. So it will use whatever features, extra additional features that are available in SQL Server 2002. So this is how you can change the compatibility level. Let's set the compatibility level to 2019 and click OK. Now the compatibility level is changed to 2019 and the database is uh, compatible with the 2019 SQL Server version and the features. So here it's set to 2019. So there's a code associated with each level. So for 2019 the code level is 150. So it reduces by 10 for each lower version. So what I will do now is I will set it to version 2022 again using Transact SQL which is having a code 160. So let's use Transact SQL. So what we'll do, uh, I will open up a new query. First of all, I will show you how you can view the compatibility level. So you need to use the select statement and you need to type uh, select compatibility underscore level. And the, there's a sys databases view from which you can get that. And name it, you don't need to specify the, you need to specify the database name as well. So let's select name as well here uh, so name is the section so we want database name along with its compatibility level so sample db has a compatibility level of 150 otherwise we can filter it out as well if we want to filter just to a specific database we can mention it like this uh, we'll just get the compatibility level for that database need type equals sign so sample db has a compatibility level of 150 which is equal to 2019 we want to set it to level 160 so let me show you how you can do that in order to do that you need to perform the alter database statement alter database and you need to specify the name of the database which is sample db and you need to set this particular so whatever sys databases contains the database properties basically so this is one of the database properties which you can change so let's change the compatibility level to level 160 which is equals over 2022 so let's execute this statement this is done so let's see if the sql server compatibility level is now changed back to sql server 2022 the database compatibility level so under option it's now changed to SQL Server 2022 
so that is how you change the compatibility level so guys we are done with this video i hope you like this video please like comment and share this video with your friends and also uh, please subscribe to my channel uh, hit on the bell notification icon select all notifications to get notifications regarding all my future videos i thank you so much for your time on this video and you have a wonderful day ahead